In this video, I'm going to share with you how you can finance buying raw land through five simple different strategies. Let's get into this. Now, before we get into the strategy here, if you're looking to get updates on great wholesale land deals, as well as strategies on how to profit from investing in raw land, be sure to tap the subscribe button, then head over to thelandflippingformula.com. There will be a link in the description below. Let's get into this now. So the first and most common strategy that's going to come to mind when financing raw land would be going to the bank. Now, this, without a doubt, is my least favorite way to get money. And I only recommend going to the bank for cash is if you're doing a very traditional type deal, like you're buying a lot in the suburbs and you're going to build on it. You want everything to be on the up and up and buy the books and squeaky clean because your personal residence is going to sit on it. So aside from that, if we're just buying lots to go ahead and flip for cash or for getaway spots, bug out spots, or to diversify a portfolio, skip the banks. If you want to build on it, I would recommend going to the bank and doing everything traditional by the books. Now let's get into some better strategies here. So another way you can finance buying raw land is by joining partnerships. Now this is great if you have absolutely no resources, but you have the hustle and you know somebody that has the money. You could have them put up the cash and you could do the hustle to go ahead and buy market and sell the property. But once again, this is another strategy that I don't like because my experience in 22 years of business, partnerships get ugly. They always do. Everybody thinks they're outworking the other person. Nothing's fair and they usually end ugly. So these top two that I just shared with you are my least favorite, but you can still absolutely leverage them to get your land deals financed. Now let's get into some that are more fun, they're creative, and they're going to leave you with complete control. Now we get to dive into my three favorite strategies. This first one here we're going to talk about is both private money and hard money. Now this seems like the hidden world of cash, but once you open the door to private and hard money and you prove yourself a worthy borrower, you could have access to literally millions of dollars to fund your deals. It's the greatest thing out there and it allows you to be in the driver's seat and maintain all creativity on your side of the table. You don't have to answer to anybody. As long as the investor's money showing up, you're in good shape. Now, this basically is you just connecting with wealthy individuals, pitching them on your investment strategy, and if they truly believe in you and or your investment, they will back you on the funding there. And I've used this for countless deals throughout my career. So if you want to learn more about private and hard money, be sure to comment below, ask any questions that you want about the topic, and I will create videos answering it for you. But three of my favorite ways, here is one of them right here. Private and hard money, definitely leverage that to fund your land deals. Now, the next one is credit cards. Now, what's awesome about credit cards is basically anybody could get a credit card and everybody has a merchant account these days. So you could absolutely use a credit card to make purchases on raw land and then flip them for profits or turn around and sell them on seller financing terms to go ahead and pay back the credit card and keep the difference for your profit creating passive income for you every single month. So credit cards are super awesome and I leverage them every single month while scaling my land investing business. Now let's dive into the final and most creative strategy here. And finally, we have seller financing. Now, if you don't know what seller financing is, it's basically an agreement between you and the seller on whatever you wanna do for the financing term. So if you find a property for $1,000, you could say, hey, I absolutely wanna purchase your property, but I'm gonna give you $40 a month for the next two years. Are you cool with that? Most times they'll agree. People just wanna get the deal done. So depending upon people's motivation and your level of creativity, you can structure any type of deal you want with seller financing. And that's why it's one of my favorite. I've bought deals leveraging seller financing and I sell deals on seller finding financing terms all day long. So it's a win-win for both sides. You don't need credit. You don't need cash up front in many cases. It's just your creativity and you're good to go. If both parties agree, you drop a contract and that's it. It's a done deal. And that's why it's one of my favorites without a doubt. So there you have it. There are five different strategies you can leverage to buying and selling and financing raw land. Now, if you stuck with me all the way to the end, I absolutely appreciate your time. And that tells me you might be interested in building a side business or a full-time business flipping raw land. So to do this, if you want to get started today, drop by the landflippingformula.com. I'll give you some strategies over there sharing how you could get started. And when you opt in there, I'll also send you great wholesale deals that you could go ahead and add to your portfolio or profit from in your business as well. So thank you so much for tuning in and I'll see you on the next video.